slurp it up, bitch, make a mess. When I pull up, you hit a vet. But getting they fall off my neck. What the f was that? All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are back with another video here. Classic one here for you guys. You've probably haven't seen me do this before. It's a build a bear prank, right? Sound not familiar? Dream? Have we done that yet? You know what, guys? It works every time. I'm not. I don't want to be the build a bear guy. The build a bear guy life chose me. We're gonna do a little bit different this time. We got my man Polly here. Shout out Polly. We're getting Polly a security shirt, and he's gonna be the security at build a bear, and he's gonna save the day and tell him that my message is allowed because usually I get kicked out and I get flamed and called a. By the way, stop calling me a. I'm not a. Okay, it's a joke. All right, guys, you can't make this up. We're literally getting this fake security shirt for Polly, and we're right in front of Build a Bear right now. They have no idea what's coming. Are you nervous, yeah, Polly? Don't lie. He's actually allowed to film here. Yeah, we're allowed to film. And you That's decided, what I'm right? Say. Yeah. Yeah, he's actually allowed to film. Here. Guys, would you would you be scared of the security or no? If you were the security and I was pranking, I wouldn't do. Any, I wouldn't be scared at all. Like you wouldn't be able to tell me what to do. That's a lie. No, you wouldn't. What do you do? Um, I'll put hands on simply you. Simply what I would do is what I'm about to do to this guy right here. Excuse me, sir. You gotta, that way. You can't go this way. That way. No, he's security. Do like a custom like something, right? Like you can put like a music or something. Yeah, custom as long as it's build a bear friendly. We're okay. Allowed. You just press that button and make sure you're. Okay. Close Could you just make sure what I'm saying is like good? And I just don't know what yeah. to say. I'm just kind of nervous. Yeah. Okay. I'm just like I don't know. Yeah. Sorry. I get you close. <clears throat> okay. All right. Roses are red. Violets are blue. I'm finna turn you around and put it inside of you. Yeah. So you can't put that in there because it's not build a bear friendly. Roses are red. Violets are blue. Yeah, that sounds pretty good to me, I think. Yeah, but it's not Build-A-Bear friendly. Wait, what so do you mean? That wasn't Build-A-Bear friendly? No. No, no, it's for my aunt, because she's, so she's like sick right now, so I just wanted to make, make a message, because it's like an yeah, inside joke yeah. we use. Oh, no, but it was just... Yeah, it doesn't really matter. Wait, how was it not Build-A-Bear appropriate, though? Because I said so when I worked here. I just don't know what else to say, really? It's inappropriate. All right, I'll try again, I guess. I, I just thought, I don't know, like, what part I was inappropriate, though? I would not put the sound in at all. No, but what was wrong with that sound? Because it's not appropriate, and I'm not allowed to say that here. Say what? No, but I, didn't use, what you but I didn't use any profanity. Yeah, still. It's up to us that we... That was the message she wanted, right? That was... Because she, like, wanted me to put in, like, a custom. Yeah, but it's up to us if it's not a... All right, I'll just do another one, I guess. Get well soon, you old f***ing hag. Yeah, so that's worse. Get well soon. So we just won't put a sound in there at all. I'm confused. I just don't understand what's happening. Was it the swear? Is that why? Like, I'm confused. Yeah. But I didn't swear in the first one, so I'm confused why it's, like... Do you want my manager to explain Yeah, could you, could you tell me? Like, could you have him come out? I'm sorry, I just don't understand what's happening here. All right, guys, well, they're getting uh, the manager on me. I don't really know what I did wrong. It's like, bro, I'm just trying to record a message for my auntie, you know what I'm saying? How's it going? I was confused, like, why I couldn't put, like, the message I, I um, did. Oh, it's just an inappropriate sound, and we don't allow that. Oh, no, but I just said get well soon. No, you didn't. They told me what you said. Do you have? Do you still have it? Because all I said was get well soon, not, um, like, no, auntie. no, it doesn't. I called her I old, but that... I didn't give you permission to film me. I said that if all my coworkers were okay with it, you could do it, but I did not, so you can... Oh, no, but they told us that we could film. They can, you can film them. They said that you can film them. I did not say you could film me. But like, I thought we no, got permission to film. You guys, um, don't leave now after we're recording the inappropriate sound. We are aware of who you are, and we will call the police. Just who so I am? Who I? Yeah. What okay, do you mean? Okay, gotta go. I will call the police. I'm just confused. They said I can't record my. Me? They said I can't record my question, my message in the bear, and now they're saying they're gonna call the cops on me. Why not? Actually, with the First Amendment right, he is allowed to do and say whatever he wants. Um, Your security here, right? I'm secure. I work with Allied Universal. Okay. And, uh, excuse me. They don't take you serious here, bro. Are we, are we serious right now? Did they check in with you when they got in here or no? Did you guys check in with me? Get, get I mean, out we, we, got a, we got permission to... Get out of here. We got permission get to film. To who? Oh. Another W over Build-A-Bear. Dude, they were having like a conference for like 20 minutes deciding whether or not I could film. They do this every time. Oh, my fitted! My fitted! Just forgot my fitted hat. Sorry about that. It's just my fitted. You notice I was just wearing this? Yeah. I just put on the birthday hat. I love you come in there and you're just agreeing with us and all of a sudden you're like, get out of here. Because we know who you are. I, I can't tell you how many times they've let us record. We successfully do it and then they go, we know who you are. It's like, bro, if you know who I am, then how do I get you guys every time? Like, I don't get it. All right, guys, we're bringing back a classic prank today. Shout out Nelk Boys. They did this in like 2012. It's a nice rack prank. We got the rack with all the hoodies on it right here. Wait a minute. What, what brand is this, bro? This is this shit looks fire. Hey, yo. Oh, we got gray, pink. Wait, okay, uh, okay. <clears throat> Trying to do a cinematic intro here. I'm getting fucked over by the wind. We got gray, pink, black, green. Ooh, summer blue. Hey, yo, that shit's hard. But yeah, so we're gonna be telling girls that they have a nice rack. Hopefully I don't get kicked off campus for being a weirdo or whatever. We'll see what happens, I don't know. It's a nice rack. It's a really nice rack. Where'd you get that? What? How much you pay for that? That thing's sick. Oh, yeah. Holy oh, like shit. $8 from Target. That's some good quality clothing here too. Damn. Excuse me? You have a really nice... Huh? What'd you say? I was saying you have a really nice rack. I was talking to him. 
I'm gonna try. <laughs> She's not here. Oh my god. That's a wicked nice rack. Huh? No, not you. Right here. Oh. No, right there, because we have a rack right here. So it's just a prank. <laughs> just a prank, there's a camera there. So you're supposed to re Fucking nice rack prank, dude. So dumb, so hard to, to, to do. Does no one like answer nowadays? How did Nelk do this shit so easily? What's up, bro? I think I'm on mute. I gotta unmute my, my voice. I think I'm muted. I just wanna say, that's like a wicked nice rack right there. Sorry, no, not, not you. I was talking about the rack. Sorry. Yeah. <laughs> Pretty funny. Yeah. <laughs> I quit. I quit. Let's go home. Wrap it up. I'm going to college. Excuse me? Yeah. I just wanna say, that's like a wicked nice rack right there. No, no sorry, not you. I was talking to him. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I was talking to him. What are you gonna do, flip him? Dude. Hey! It's never an easy day filming, okay? That's that's what I'm learning. I already knew I already knew that. But every day we seem to forget that. Like me and Dream were talking earlier, we're like, dude, this is gonna, we're gonna bang this out in like two hours. It's already been a f hour. Not one person's even turned around. We're showing them the hard side of filming, okay? Everyone just shows you all the takes. We're showing you guys the hard side. <laughs> guys, the prank has gone wrong. Uh I wouldn't call him a bozo, but I'm with him, yeah. You guys think you're being funny? What do you mean? Well, we're getting calls that you're harassing people. I know, I, I can see what's how, going on. How are you harassing people? How do you think? It's a, it's a rack. Yeah, but what you're saying is inappropriate. But I said nice. Oh, no, I didn't oh. say it was illegal. Oh, okay. It's a fine line between playing some stupid prank, like nice rack. No, nice rack prank, because it's a rack. Now, are you guys students? No, he's a student. Okay. This guy gets in trouble. Oh, I don't oh if, he's, if he's the only one getting in trouble, then that's fine with me. No, no. To be honest, I'm just saying. I don't, like, want, I don't, I don't want any problems. No, you can, yeah, and take him. super cool of you. Yeah. Oh, I don't. Yeah, I personally, don't, I personally don't care. But I didn't even think of it like that. I just thought it was like a nice it time. It might not be criminal, right? okay? But at some point, it gets to that point. Okay. At what you point? At what point? Stop. Even if it's like, because we're, you know, I mean, I'm not, I'm not, actually, I'm not even talking saying, to the girls, you know. It wouldn't be right, but like I said, there's a fine line, and guess what? You can go explain it to the judge. You know what I mean? Nah. And we don't want to have to. So you're not a student. No, I'm not so a student. So why don't you start stepping? There? Start stepping. Okay, start stepping. Am I going to trespass? Because if you're, well, you're going to be. I thought it was a public oh, campus. Walk away. We're not. Oh, you want to walk away? Yeah. Well, well you asked him for his ID. Go fucking step over there okay. right now, okay? I will walk. Okay. Wait, what do you mean? You asked for his ID. I, am I talking to him or am I talking to him? You're talking to him. You're talking to him. No, he does call me daddy, though. Seriously. I'm just saying. I'm just. <laughs> yeah, well, that is our rack, to be fair. Should we just grab the rack? Okay, yeah, cool. Could you just make sure he knows that you told us to stay here before he says that we're not leaving? All right, cool. Yeah, it's, it's, a it's a misunderstanding here. Why is Cam the one taking the fall? <laughs> Poor Cam, bro. Cam is literally helping us out with the prank. He's not even on the channel. He doesn't even go here either. <laughs> He's taking all the fall. Kind of badass, huh? Cops. Kind of badass, though, right? Cops. Cop. Because I'm a bad boy. <laughs> Dude, I'm just kidding. No? I know, right? Dude, Cam is just... Yeah, he's, he's himself over. First thing he said was, are you with this bozo? <laughs> I can grab it right now. Yep. You get what you're trying to do. You got a lot of sensitive people around here. You ain't God forbid you misgender something on top of it. Thanks, officer. Sorry about that. And we are free to walk. Came out of nowhere. It's just like, I go here. I was like, okay. Dude, when I threw Cam under the bus, that was so funny, bro. I literally was just like, yeah, you can take him away. I don't really give a fuck as long as I can go. <laughs> he was get to step in. I was like, I was like, you just asked for the ID. He's like, the fuck out of here. <laughs> All right, guys, you already know where we're at right now. Why? I feel like, bro, I just feel like. At this point, it's just kind of cringe, bro. Everyone just goes to Walmart. But it's like, it's the best for everything, bro. It's big. There's a lot of characters in there. Guys, I'm getting flashbacks. I'm not going to lie. I'm getting flashbacks of being in here. We were um, escorted out last time by a, a lovely woman named Pauline. She's a gr great woman. Oh, no. Oh, no. Pauline saw us. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Oh, no. Pauline, stop. I want a manager now. Oh, way out of line. Pauline, well, Pauline. All right. I will not have we'll leave. I think you're both way out of line. But we're leaving. What we're trying to do is get someone to answer a question, and if they get the question right, I'm gonna give them a hundred dollars cash. Would you be interested in answering a question to possibly want a hundred dollars if you get it right? Sure. Who is the host of Family Feud? Like Steve Harvey. Before him? Before him. Oh shit. What's Ooh. Um, you got it. You got it, Andy. Andy. Yep. I can't remember the name. Oh, you got it, Andy. Mila Milanak. Mil was it Milanak? Yeah, Andy Milanakis. Really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You got it right. No. Yeah. Back, no, before Steve Harvey, right before right. him. Yeah. It was? You got it, yeah. Oh, shit. $100 for you. Hey, what the hell just happened? Do you see that? That's what happened. Do you see that? Money, I guess. 
Well, they do say money grows on trees. <laughs> you get it? I need that tree. You get the joke, you get the joke right? Right, yeah. <laughs> Can you explain it? Money grows on trees because that's paper. <laughs> Got it. Got it. Thank you. Andy Milanakis, the former host of Family Feud. Oh, see, this is what I'm talking about Walmart, bro. You just get the best people every time. It's automatic. Would well, you want to answer a question? Possibly $100. We're just doing like a giveaway for questions today? Sure, of course. All right, cool. Name two characters off the show Family Family Guy. Name two characters. Lois and Peter. Oh, my. all right, all right. You got it. You got it. 100 bucks. 100 bucks. How'd you do that? <laughs> what the f was that? That was Biden that you put it on. What do you mean? Flame? Flame? Oh no. Oh my god. No, it's just my diss track. <laughs> not interested? <laughs> no interest. No interest. Can't be taking pictures Oh no, we're not taking pictures of video. Well not because we're just recording because we found we're gonna buy this wall and then it caught off. <laughs> you cannot be doing that in here. Did you see that? I did. And you better not be recording us right now. No, we're not recording, it's just a vi do you see that though? Marsha? Oh no. No. Oh fuck. What, we were documenting because I was going to buy this wallet and then look, look what happened to me when I hit it on fire. Don't record me, okay? Oh, you won't record you. So I shouldn't jump in that ball pit over there? <laughs> I'm, just, I'm just tickling your I'm just tickling your pickle, bud. We're not leaving, we're finessing. Guys, are we going to follow? Okay, this is what we're going to do. This is how you escape Walmart. We've done it a couple times. Ready? How do they, how do they know? <laughs> oh, how did you guys see us? All right, all right, we'll leave now. We'll leave now. All right. You guys wouldn't mind being a decoy right now, would you? We're trying to escape from two people that are trying to kick us out. Would you mind just going out there, like causing a scene, and I'll just run out the back door? Oh, we're trying to just escape the store because they're trying to kick us out right now, two people that work here. So if you guys wouldn't mind, just go, like, cause a scene in the front, and then we'll just I'm escape out the back. No, just cause, like, a scene, though. I'm not no, just so we could leave. Yeah. You go that out yourself, though. I'm taking my glass and hoodie off, they'll never know. Play down, play down. I'm confused. No, that was my twin, that wasn't me. That was my twin brother. She's laughing. No, but that wasn't me. That was my twin. That wasn't me, though. It was my twin. I got addicted to winning. I think it's a habit. There ain't no such thing as something that's out of my league. If I want it, I grab it.